ok now let's try to deploy this uh, function to the Azure so let's go to the uh, Azure Blade and you can see this deploy to function app so let's click on that so you can select a subscription and you have to uh, give a function application name so I will say Python I will say order trigger I will say create new function app in Azure so I will say order processing and you can see it's going to create the storage account and uh, the function app so if we go to the output tab you will be able to see it's going to create the resource group and the storage account so it will create a new storage account for the order trigger with this uh, name in the West US so you can see the order trigger is uh, created with this URL so let's move to the portal so I will go to the all resources now I will search this one order trigger so the storage account is created as order trigger mm, so I will go to the uh, function app and I will move to the storage account as well I will move it I will move to the uh, apps uh, function app from this window so you will be able to see the uh, you, this is the function app under that you will be able to see the uh, functions available so you can see the uh, function is deployed with the name order trigger and this is the function and this is your function app so you can create multiple functions inside the one function app so I will uh, go inside this function so you can't uh, modify anything in this uh, python file because we have deployed it from uh, uh, IDE from Visual Studio Code uh, so let's move to the function app and check the function app settings so it shows the function app settings the ver uh, version uh, function app function version available in the host .json and I will go to the configurations and check 
whether the storage connection string is available you can see the in the Azure web job storage key you can see the uh, connection string to the storage account with the account name order trigger so that storage account is created in here in the West US region so we don't have any queues created yet so let's uh, try to run the uh, trigger Let's get the function URL. Let's run this one. So we haven't passed any parameters. So let's pass some parameters. and pass the location we are getting some errors So the order should be it should be order trigger in this format. So it's not working uh, even though we are passing the correct parameters order and location. If you go to the function log it shows uh, this my storage connection string is not configured. So in we have to go to the application settings uh, and configure the connection string from there. So in the next video Let's try to configure the uh, connection string and run this uh, Azure function application successfully.